Now with preparations for the Denver presidential debate just 50 hours away, a new ABC News Washington Post poll showing President Barack Obama with a narrow two-point lead over Mitt Romney heading into Wednesday night's debate, a lead that could strengthen or disappear depending on what happens at DU Wednesday night. This is the stage the candidates will face off on Wednesday night inside the Ritchie Center. Crews still working to put the final touches on it. Tonight, the candidates will get their first walkthrough on the set. That's actually going to happen tomorrow. Now, Seven News reporter Mark Stewart is at Wings Over the Rockies right now. And Mark, Mitt Romney will be the first candidate in town for the debate, expected there later this evening. 7.15 tonight, Mike, and this visit here is significant because this is the governor's first and, as we know, only public appearance before Wednesday night's debate here in Colorado. As to what he is saying, it is spelled out in those four banners behind me, jobs. You see the blue and white lettering. Expect Governor Romney tonight to take some swipes at the policies of the last four years, but also expect to hear a broader message and a vision for the future past the Obama administration. This this past weekend, the governor has spent a lot of time preparing for the debate, so perhaps tonight this audience will be used as a test group to uh, perhaps test out some lines that he will use during the debate. What happens here tonight and on Wednesday will be critical because, as we've been reporting, a new ABC News poll has Governor Romney down, in some cases double digits, in all of the swing states, including Colorado. Again, Governor Romney here at the Wings Over the Rockies tonight at 7.15. For now, we are live in Denver, Mark Stewart, 7 News. Thank you, Mark. President Obama also planning a rally in Denver. His will be Thursday morning after Wednesday night's debate. Three Denver area campaign offices began handing out tickets to the Sloan's Lake event just minutes ago.